guys, welcome back to uh, League of Rowan. I'm Adrian, and we have got some cards from mom today. All right, my mom goes to her local Target, looks for baseball cards to send me, and hopes and prays we get an auto. So we're still on an auto search for mom here. We got some 2022 Topps Allen and Ginter, and 2022 Topps Capstone. I haven't opened any of this personally myself, so pretty excited this is the one I think that we got a better chance of getting an auto on so I'm gonna start with the Allen and Ginter little odds here for you what's the odds for an auto so I see an odd on here for a mini baseball player autograph one in 173 packs I think that's our best shot at getting an autograph there are other like booklets and stuff you can get to but um let's see if we can get Cool auto out of one of these packs. Alan Ginter, one of those weird sets that has this kind of stuff in it. Let's see, Murphy. Stand up comedian from Ireland, it looks like. All right, there's a nice Aaron Judge. Byron Buxton. Nice Miggy. We know who the Miggy's going to. We got a mini of this dude, canoe, canoe guy, and then for my A's, we got Sean Murph. We got high number short prints in this, so I always take a look at those if that's anything over 300, so like 301 to 350 or something like that. Oh, there we go. I've been looking for this card for my sister. I don't think she's gotten it yet, so she's going to be stoked about that. Nice Derek Jeter. Rod Carew. Paul Dijon. We got a ham sandwich versus a pork roll. And famous rivals. That's uh, Alan and Ginter for you there. Some mini Steve Carlton. Ooh, Alan and Ginter back. And a Garrett Cole. All right, Brian Reynolds. Bryce Harper. Roger Maris. It's been a Yankees box, hasn't it? Garrett Cole pitching a gem. There's a mini Sutcliffe and Carlos Correa. All right, we got Steve Carlton, Pedro Martinez, Ian Happ, Clayton Kershaw, a back door, and a Jose Siri rookie. This Ian Happ is one of the high number short prints. Interesting. What is this back door? Typically hitters freeze up on back door pitches. These breaking balls appear to be headed outside, but then duck and nip the edge of the plate, sneaking in the back door. Hmm. Interesting. I think I'm gonna quick rip the rest of these packs here. All right. Got a quick, when you quick, Quick rip, Allen and Ginter. You gotta be careful. Those minis like to slide it out of there. All right, we got CJ Cron for the Rockies. Any Banks. That's a nice one. Lorenzo Kane. Got another sandwich card. Uh, there's a cool Kirby Puckett card. That's nice. Rom Yout. Chipper Jones. Very nice. This dude. Winter Games. Curling guy. Cool. Roger Hornsby, that's a nice one. That's a high number short print. There's a nice uh, Greg Maddox. Ooh, we got a black border of Jose Miranda. That's a nice rookie card right there. Uh, Roy Capanella. A journalist. Walker Bueller, Babe Ruth. Potato chips. This uh, rip is making me hungry. Uh, there's a mini of CJ Cron, and that's the uh, Allen and Ginter back. Those are a little bit more short printed than the, the normal. We got a Joe West. That's pretty cool uh, umpire card. Uh, Mel Ott. Uh, Tony Olivia. Kushel. Kershaw. Oh, there's a nice mini. Mike Trout. I dig that one. And then the last is an Eloy Jimenez. So no auto in this box. Let's see if Capstone treats us a little bit better. All right. You don't get odds with Panini, but you get like 
a list of what you could get in there. So, um, capstone is probably it for Panini Baseball. Um, I was just talking about the podcast last week that Panini doesn't have a contract with the MLBPA anymore. So, no Panini Baseball cards scheduled for the 2023 season. Um, I wasn't too high on Panini anyways. Um, I, it is still kind of a bummer because they do make gorgeous looking cards. I just always would get irritated with the redemptions and um, panini points and what have you. But as you can see here, Capstone is a really pretty looking set. Yoan Moncada. There is a rookie of Thomas Shep Sheputsky. I'm, I know I'm butchering that name. But um, uh, there's a rookie of Matt Brash. There's a nice rookie of Vidal Brujan in the blue. And a crest of Mookie Betts. That is a nice looking card. And I have someone in mind for this bad boy here. Jordan Alvarez. Jose Miranda rookie. Hunter Green rookie. Crazy good pitcher for the Reds. There's the blue foil of Joan Adon rookie card and Francisco Lindor Summit card. Very nice looking cards. All right, next up we got Kyle Muller rookie card. We got a Byron Buxton. Ooh, this is a nice Chaz McCormick blue rookie card. These are the pre, I forget what the name of these are, premium something like that this different design here Otto Lopez rookie card in the blue and a new age Trey Turner insert all right next up we got a Liam Hendricks Joan Duran rookie Lars Newpar rookie dig that Jesse Winker in the blue and a deja vu of Alex Rodriguez and Fernando Tatis Jr. I have somebody in mind for this one as well. We're down to two packs. I hope I can get an auto. Do we have one? Do we have one? I think it's a flipped over card. Maybe, maybe. Austin Hayes. Joe Musgrove. Look at that. Look at that. Mom, we got you an auto. It is Patrick Mazika. Uh, rookie for the Mets. He is a rookie this year, is it? Wasn't he? I believe so. I think I've gotten his auto and some other stuff. But there we go. Not too shabby. Autograph. All right. Then we got Jazz Chisholm Jr. and a Big Bang Matt Olson. Dig that one. It's got a little ding on the corner here, but still a really cool looking card. All right. I'm still. Because you just never know. You never know about last pack magic. Where are all my good luck charms? All right, got all the good luck charms here for the last pack, even though we did succeed in getting an autograph for mom here. Not too shabby. All right, let's get into it. Maybe we'll get like a numbered card. I might be getting too greedy here. It is nice we got an autograph. All right, we got Jeff McNeil. Oh, there we go. The last pack magic worked. Biggest rookie you can get. A nice Julio Rodriguez. Not too shabby. Ooh, this Jose Siri rookie is the gold. Are these numbers? No, oh, but that's a nice looking card. And an O'Neill Cruz rookie. Wow, last pack, last pack magic worked big time. And a Kevin Guzman Toronto Velo card. This was not too shabby at all. I'm super excited that I'm gonna have a video that I can tell my mom that we got the autograph she was looking for. Um, so much fun. So awesome. thank you guys so much for watching. Have a good day.